about the journey from Salaga to Abromase being long and tortuous did not really mean much to us until we decided to make the trip. I can remember at least six hours of journey time. One hour and 30 minutes from Salaga through Makango to the White Volta, another one hour to cross the water body on a ferry. And then another three or so hours via road. At the Abrumase Health Center, some children from the community are clearing the weeds. That's all they can do something about because the solution to the other challenges here, such as leaking roofs, cracked walls and lack of medical equipment is beyond them. Paul Jebuni, the midwifery officer here, tells me the facility was downgraded to a health center status. The staffs are not enough, especially we don't have a physician assistant. As a health center, we're supposed to have a physician assistant. And this affects our works in a way in that we cannot prescribe certain drugs to the people here. Health insurance people came here and downgraded the facility to a health uh, to a cheap compound. This facility, which serves more than 10 small villages in the enclave, has more issues. How to even sterilize our instrument is an issue. We need to boil them before we reuse. We don't have autoclave to be able to sterilize our instrument. We need oxygen because when we get a case that needs oxygen, we need to refer the person. And you can see the distance to the nearest health facility. The person might lose, lose his or her life. Pregnant women are skipping antenatal visits and maternal health care access is taking a hit. The few staff who have decided to stay here and work are having to contend with this accommodation facility also leaking badly. This is the accommodation facility belonging to the health workers. As you'd find, even the door to the accommodation has some cracks here. We'll, we'll get in shortly. And so... Once, once you get into the facility, you would immediately be greeted with um, some of the roofs that are falling apart. As you see there, the ceiling are broken apart. And then we will quickly come to an area which is being used as a, a makeshift kitchen. So you find a coal pot here, and it's been partitioned with just this plywood. So another staff can use the other side as a kitchen or certain area. The East Gonja Municipal Health Director Zakaria Kasim says the directorate is working to address the staffing challenge despite the unavailability of human resources. We would have wished that being the only referral facility in that area, possibly if it can be renovated and expanded so that uh, we can get a physician assistant. One of the staff there has gone for training in physician assistantship and uh, will be completing this year and with that he will still have to do his housemanship for one year and so that will be looking at 2024 uh, uh, sometimes it's just the will to go and in the numbers too are few this intervention by MP for Salaga South Haji Azuera Ibrahima appears to be a stopgap to deal with an even bigger crisis situation. The women were worried that they go there and the health attendants are, are male. So they kept saying, Hajia, we want her. So I got a, a, a midwife posted there so that she can take care of the women issues. Anytime something becomes a little bit critical, they have to go to Yeji. So most times when you are entering a Bromasi, you meet the ambulance either going or coming. Because every now and then, it is transporting a patient to, to, to the Yeji hospital. Well, Municipal Health Director Zakaria Kasim says the pressing needs of the Abrumase Health Center will be factored in the 2023 budget for the municipality. Unfortunately, it wasn't part of the 2022 District Assembly budget. Uh, it has been postponed and we will look at it in the 2023 a budget which will soon be discussed at the district assembly. If you know how these state agency bureaucracies work, this facility may not get the needed fix anytime soon.
And if you find yourself in a medical emergency, you would have to endure a three or four hour long rugged journey to Yeji. If it happens at night, it may take longer, like it took us on our return from Abrumase to Yeji. 